This is a 36-year-old female with sudden onset left upper extremity paresthesias and weakness. The images, which are motion degraded, demonstrate a rel well, relatively well circumscribed ovoid T1 slightly hyperintense, T2 stir hyperintense lesion within the left posterior aspect of the upper cervical spinal cord. The lesion has convex borders and enhances. Differential diagnosis includes infectious or inflammatory demyelinating disease, underlying vascular malformation, glioma, or metastatic disease. The patient also underwent imaging of the brain, which demonstrated multiple infarcts in the left anterior and posterior inferior cerebellar artery territories. A subsequent four-vessel angiogram demonstrated a dissection in the distal segment, distal second segment of the left vertebral artery. The diagnosis for the cervical spine signal abnormality in this case was a focal infarct. Follow-up MR imaging of the cervical spine demonstrated resolution of the focal signal abnormality with a small focus of myelomalacia developing at that site. Most cases of cord infarct are idiopathic with atherosclerosis attributed as the main cause in up to one-third of cases. Other etiologies include trauma, embolism, hypotension, and radiation-induced vasculopathy. Symptoms appear quickly with maximum symptomatology at 12 hours post-ictus.